everyone this is Bo Purdue again and I'm making another video on the same day as the last one that I posted this is Matoka we're coming through Matoka West Virginia and I think I'm going to go home on the back roads and see what the autumn foliage is like down in Clark's Gap and all of those places And maybe stop at the top of Herndon Mountain for some photographs of the sunset. In case you didn't see it in the last video, they've demolished a lot of the burned up buildings that were in Matoka. And this here is the route I'm going to take home, Old Matoka Road. I'm going to go home through the mountains. And I was looking to see how the leaves have changed up here. And I am not going to be disappointed, I can tell. Like I said before, this is filmed on the same day as the last video that I uploaded. And it's September 27th, so it's late September right now. And on the Mercer County side of the mountain, the leaves have already really started to change. This actually seems a little early to me. But you know what? I'm going to enjoy it anyway. Wow. Got the yellows and oranges. Don't know if there's going to be a sunset at the top of the mountain or not, but it was one of the main reasons I went this way. Probably be too overcast for that, but dang if this foliage isn't beautiful. Some kind of work going on up here, I believe. Probably finishing for the day. Don't know exactly what time it is, but I'd say it's about... About 6 o'clock in the evening, I'd say. That was a deer. Sign it's time to slow down. Now look how beautiful all this is. Of course I'll come back up here probably in a week maybe make another video and if not make another video definitely take some photographs got my camera in my backpack right now but uh, it's not at peak now it'll be even better 
for photographs and videos next week. Here's another patch of nice foliage. This will be even more beautiful in about a week. There's that beaver dam down there. If you could see it on the GoPro.
Okay, now there's the blue building. Lord, this is a mess. really getting cooler so we're getting closer to the top of the mountain it's actually been unseasonably cool the last few days and I think that's why the leaves have changed so quickly I may run out of motorcycle riding season before autumn's completely over with if I do I may experiment with some other types of content for this channel Maybe a sunset after all. The sky's really beautiful back through there. Look at that.
the side of the road and see yeah it looks like we got some color in the sky that might be worth a photograph yeah i'm gonna stay here and some photographs of this okay everyone i've got my camera set up now my canon eos rp and i'm getting some beautiful photographs of the sunset up here at my favorite sunset location at the top of herndon mountain on the line between wyoming and mercer county west virginia as you already know if you've seen my other videos that i've posted where i came up here and looks like by this time next year it's going to be too overgrown to use so i'm trying to make the best of it now while i can but i sure have gotten a lot of really beautiful photographs up here if you've seen my facebook and instagram or if you've been following me for a very long time hold on a second while i get my camera adjusted this area we go. so by next spring I should be able to put content online with the regularity of a normal YouTuber. I hope. And I may start making other content besides the motorcycle videos. Because that's not all I do. That's not the only adventures that I have. I do a ton of other stuff. And I would like this YouTube channel to be, to include all of that rather. And in time I hope I can turn this into something really great. I really enjoy making videos and I especially enjoy photography. There's not many circumstances that I could see that would cause me to give up on videos. So like I said, if there's another break in the content over winter, don't unsubscribe and don't get worried. And there's absolutely nothing that I could think of that could happen in my life that would make me give up photography. Those of you who know me, know that photography pretty much is my life it's became more than just a hobby over the past few years and I really would like to get to the point with this blog and with the photos themselves if I can where I could go a lot more places and do a lot more things with it I'll probably get into how I got into photography and how this became such a big part of my life in a later video. But I can say that photography probably saved my life. Right now I'm just out doing the things that I've done for the last few years that have helped me through some hard times in life. Taking photographs and riding my motorbike here. This by no means is stuff I've started doing just for YouTube. I'm doing what everyone who gives advice on these things should say you should do with a YouTube channel. I'm just out enjoying myself living my life and making video content with it and hoping that the subscribers and the fans come but since i already got quite a bit of video riding in here i think this will be where i conclude it i will get some more photographs of this gorgeous sunset that's forming for my facebook and instagram pages Those are where I have my best following right now, even though I've been neglecting the Instagram page lately, too. 
I'm sorry for that if you're an Instagram follower. I'll get all my recent photographs on there probably during the downtime this winter. But I think this is where I'll conclude this video and this beautiful sunset. Hope you all like and subscribe. Like I said, there may be other breaks in the content coming this winter, but I'll try to get enough videos this fall to make up for that, to not have to do that. And I'll start doing my other content too. But there will always be more videos coming to this, I think. But for now, I'm signing off to do what I do best. Thank you all. Please like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.